Hey guys, this is the Encourager, Queen C No Longer Bound. Welcome, thank you for clicking. Let's do today's mind trip. While we suffer from an addiction, be it alcohol, drugs, gambling, sex, or overeating, often we do these things to comfort ourselves. It may have been something we turned to when we started going through tough times. But now we use the vice as the answer to all issues, even though it was the coping mechanism for our first issue. The addiction is tied to the affliction, which is at the core of you. There is freedom for you, but it will take you to free you. In giving yourself to God, also give the affliction to God who will help you with the addiction. I trust you, God. Let's look at Psalms 142, verses 5 through 7. David said, I cried out to you, O Lord. I said, you are my refuge, my portion in the land of the living. Attend to my cry. For I am brought very low. Deliver me from my persecutors, for they are stronger than I. Bring my soul out of prison, that I may praise your name. The righteous shall surround me, for you shall deal bountifully with me. Let's pray. Father God, I need your help with me. Actually, with the core of me. Because at the core of my addiction is my affliction. I have tried to fix what is wrong with me by using outside sources that made me feel good for a moment or not feel at all. Yet, when I come back to normal, the pain returns and I am still broken. God, I know how, I know I, I have tried to use everything, everything else besides you my creator. Now I'm seeking you because you know me, the core of me. I place my affliction in your hands and I ask that you take my addiction so I can heal. God, I trust you. In Jesus' name I pray. Amen. This is Mind Trip by Dr. William Curry Jr. This is the Encourager Queen C. We'll see you right here next time.